A staple in the independence community has been vandalized yet again. The Nows Ray Daniel takes us to Bingham Wagner Estate, where leaders are now having to fork over hundreds of dollars to pay for damages. It's closed for the season, but that didn't stop vandals from coming in and destroying 18 window panes and part of a window frame. I'm angered, quite frankly. This is the fourth bit of vandalism the Bingham Wagner State has had in the last year. 17 year volunteer Steve Schreiber has been busy patching up what vandals have left behind. It always costs money, it costs manpower. And uh, for the people of Independence, I would tell them, you know, some of your tax money, this is what it has to go to wanton destruction. The state is run mostly by volunteers. Just so we have to make up the money that it costs to repair this damage. TripAdvisor recently named Bingham Wagner as the number one thing to do in Independence. With the latest vandalism, Schreiber says it's disheartening. This, this is the kind of thing that hurts cities, it, it hurts neighborhoods. So I want these people to learn their lesson right now and I think we can do it. Now there is a $1,000 reward for anyone who knows who vandalized this property. In Independence, Ray Daniel for the Now KC.